Come one, come all. Welcome to the magical theater of the strange and fantastic. Once upon a time, before everything went to rack and ruin, the Moon Realm was ruled by a beautiful goddess. But then, Little Bear, for whom the Moon Goddess had shown nothing but love, stole two of his mistress's precious possessions, the Black Moonstone and a magic pair of scissors known as Calibrus. After declaring himself Moon Bear King, he invaded the goddess's castle, smashed the white moonstone to pieces. Once upon a time, I once upon a now. This is my moon jeans, so just get to the part where I sound good. <laughs> right, uh, yes, of course, <laughs> of course. Wasn't everyone so very wowed when the moon goddess was obliterated? Wasn't it just great that the impressive Moon Bear King <laughs> gave a piece of the White Moonstone to each of his generals, screwing over the moon at large? Oh yes, the next three years were something special. Ah, yes. Now, where do I begin? He was the Moon Realm's ruthless new king, and intended to keep it that way. So night after night he spirited away the souls of children and locked them inside wooden puppets who were doomed to defend Castle Grizzlestaff. And while tonight was no exception, it would prove to be quite exceptional. The poor dearie. Look, Yin Yang, another day, another soul. Poor indeed. You're as bad as the tyrant. How many of these children are you planning to parade off to certain mutilation before you realize you're wasting your time? Why, one more and then another after that. As many as it takes me to get my hands on Calibrus. <laughs> Meet our hapless hero, who's just blinked back to life, firmly in the Moonbear King's clutches. Oh. Kutaro, Kutaro, your soul was summoned here at my behest. Kutaro, will you be my friend? Pals to the bitter end. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Lovely. Another dunce who left his head in the Moon Bear King's belly. Listen, you're going to drop dead if you go without a head. And I'll be the one stuck with cleanup. Come on, let's find something else you can use. A substitute head. What's rattling around? It's a head. <laughs> this should be. Hmm, you're all set. Remember those head pots. They may be weird, but they flap around with lots of useful heads. But one little touch, and they'll drop their stash. You know, a new kid on the chopping block like you ought to have a couple of noggins, at least. Can't take any chances. <sighs> See? Just like I said. Blast it! What am I doing wrong? Am I not powerful enough? This is if you don't grab them right away, their magic will fade and no more head. So remember, if you lose your head, pick it up post haste. Oh, and one other thing, moon sparkles. <laughs> Here, I'll show you. Voila! These 
These are mute sparkles. Collect 100 and you'll be able to magically come back to life, even if you do lose all your heads. Let's keep looking. Keep your eyes peeled for moon sparkles if you want to stay alive. Rawr! 